It all comes down to procedures. Some gaskets you have to stick to the block. Some, like this Pontiac, you have to put it, stick it all to the pan or you end up with leaks on the seams. Well, we have the election not too far down, down the road. And a lot of social media platforms are going to be making adjustments for their mistakes in the past and the leaks that they have now. YouTube has just instituted a new policy where you won't be able to go live from your mobile unless you have a thousand plus subscribers. Most of us will never reach that plateau and that's by YouTube's own design. Small channels aren't put into the mainstream and aren't allowed to grow. Therefore, when the election comes along and people want to participate, they will have a very limited platform to do so because small channels like mine won't be allowed to participate. I said it before, I'll say it again. YouTube does not care about you. And they sure in the hell would like to get rid of people like me. So, if you're not offended by the attempted coup that just happened in this country, you damn well should be. If you don't know the players, at least some of them, let me remind you with this little song. Paul Harley, if Saturday Night Live can do it, we can do it too, right? You know Brenner and Clapper, Podesta and Clinton, Struck Page and Comey, and that other Clinton. But do you recall? The most the biggest, biggest traitor of all. Barry the Red Bone Leftist had a very shiny turd. He sold it to an entire nation. Now it's time to flip in the bird. All of the other leftists used to praise and call him great. Now they'll just have to watch him eating from a prison plate. Then one awesome Christmas Eve, the Donald came to say, Barry, with your turd so bright, we're flushing your ass down the toilet tonight. As all the wolves were swinging, the people shouted out with glee. Barry, the red bone leftist, you fell down in history. He fell down in his story.